Well, Gizmo turned 16 in September. Just getting the video up now. You can see she's still got her jump height. Goes right to where the Earth Pulse is. And we've hidden the Earth Pulse before. Set the bed up on both ends of the couch. And she always ends up on the end of the couch. It's got the Earth Pulse running. Um, take a look at these eyes. 16 years old. They're a lot clearer at 16 than they were at 7.5 before she got on the Earth Pulse. You can see... Uh, her tongue there, she's got two teeth under that tongue, no teeth on top, total of four teeth in her mouth in case you don't think she's 16. Incredibly motivated by food, hard to grab things without the teeth. Amazingly quick, I mean she's got absolutely no joint pain, otherwise she wouldn't be so lively and spunky. Incredibly motivated by food. I mean, her mental state is three, four, five years old. Five at the max. I've had a lot of dogs in my ears. And, um, okay, watch this. Whoops. Alright, she soccer kicks that one. Doesn't know where it went. You can see how good her eyes work here in a second. Alright, whoops, there it is. The dog eats, Gizmo eats a pound of food a day, split into three separate meals. That's like me eating 30 pounds of food a day at 150 pounds, split into 10 pound <laughs> um, meals. So, so much for the theory that undernutrition is uh, the best way to extend uh, longevity. She's uh, probably the only animal, the only dog at 16 years old that can uh, walk on her hind legs or stand on her hind legs as long as she does. And she's got incredible strength in her hind legs. You saw that by jumping onto the couch and look at that hang time right there. I mean I don't think there's another dog like that anywhere. Um, so if you want to sleep like Gizmo and um, age as slowly as she's aging. I mean, she only got on the thing when she was seven and a half years old. Imagine if she'd started Earth Pulse when she was an adolescent. Um, I believe that the younger you get on the Earth Pulse, the longer you're going to live. That's where the triple lifespan comes in. I think if you were to get on this thing at 21 years old, you'd probably be locked into your 20s for about five decades, seriously. At 52, uh, excuse me, 53 now, um, I still run circles around myself at 25. I can surf long. I can surf more days in a row than in more hours per session than I could when I was 25. Three, three sessions in a row, uh, two and a half to three hours, would just, you know, my back and my, my neck would just be destroyed. I've always had neck and back issues. Those are gone. Uh, my left shoulder, which was destroyed, um, dislocated the first time in 1986, and dislocated, I kept track, 22 times um, up through the mid-90s. Um, you know, my, my left rotator cuff is completely regenerated. It doesn't pop or click anymore. I used to have a hard time lifting my elbow past there, and now range of motion is precisely the same as my right. Um, all my other sports injuries are healed. My, my ankle, right ankle, knee, and hip from an old pole vaulting incident in, in uh, high school um, was giving me trouble in my mid-30s. I'd get out of bed in the morning and I'd, I'd limp all the way into the kitchen until my, my ankle warmed up and uh, completely gone. So your, your body goes into healing mode and um, your hormone levels get elevated because your endocrine tissues are stimulated um, all proportionately. Um, you guys doing HGH injections, you're just shutting down your natural production. It's like a crutch. So, um, you know, even melatonin does the same thing. I mean, melatonin is a great antioxidant, but um, particularly for the brain. But if you've got the earth pulse, your, your, your free radical production just... Pff, goes down to next to nothing. Uh, you can train like a banshee and you don't get sore.
because you never go into anaerobic metabolism. You're not producing any lactic acid. I've had guys, you know, that train so hard that, you know, they can barely walk out of the gym, tell me that, you know, their, their pain levels drop to near zero, where they used to be, where they used to run consistently at a five to eight. Um, guys that train constantly, but people primarily that, you know, change their, their, uh, their training routine. So they're o always sore. Um, so I'm going to go to some studies right now. Um, you know, if I'll tell you, if you want to feel and perform at half your age, you know, I mean, uh, I mean, look at me, I'm 53. Um, I, I look at pictures of myself at 40 before the earth pulse. And I think I look younger. So, um, anyway, but then maybe that's all in my head. I don't know. Anyway, um, give us a call. I'm a one man show. You'll speak to me directly. Um, you know, outside of the manufacturing aspect of uh, the company. So I look forward to hearing from you. I'm going to show you some studies right now. And, uh, you know, the, the, the three major studies that, um, that uh, verify this whole oxygen metabolism thing. Um, and uh, I promise you, you haven't felt this, this good in decades.